We'll see you back here in just a few minutes. All right, Matt, thank you. This is a story that made national headlines. The owners of a Southern Arizona Mexican restaurant took a whole lot of heat from some in their own community after supporting President Donald Trump during the 2016 campaign. Now that the president's been in the White House for a year and a half, has anything changed? News 4 Tucson's Eric Pink has the story. It's new at 10. Jorge and Betty Rivas are preparing for the dinner rush. The couple owns Sammy's Mexican Grill in Catalina against the backdrop of the mountains. I need uh, two pieces of chicken for the chicken strips. Jorge emigrated here from El Salvador. He and his wife were both early Trump supporters. Tough decisions are, all, all, are only made by tough leaders. And, and other politicians do not have the guts and the, and, the, and, and the cojones to make those decisions. In March 2016, during then candidate Trump's only campaign stop in Tucson, he welcomed Betty Rivas on stage. That memory cemented in their restaurant now, but it created some turbulent times for business. A lot of negativity, a lot of threats. People saying, we'll make sure that your business go down. We'll make sure that uh, you guys go out of business. We'll even threat of burning down the place. So it was very scary. You depend on your job to support your family. Riva says privately, customers would tell him they also support the future president. But we are afraid to say it out loud. We are scared to say it to our our friends or our family, because if we express what we really, how we really feel about Donald Trump, people are going to turn against us, just like just what happened to you guys. After 18 months in office, the Rivas' support for the president hasn't wavered. A hundred years from now, Donald Trump will be considered one of the greatest presidents. As for business these days, the only thing that I worry about is make sure that I have enough food to settle people and, I, and that, I'm, that I'm healthy and I'm here to provide a good service. Rivas voted for Barack Obama in 2008. In 2016, President Trump won nearly 30% of the Latino vote. I'm Eric Fink, News 4, Tucson.